So when you get a piece of salmon like this from Alaska, um, very often what doesn't happen is the pin bones aren't removed. So what a lot of people do with their pin bones is they use pin bone pliers. They just are just needle nose pliers. And if you've used much with the needle nose pliers, you'll know that they really gum up really easy. The better solution are these pin bone tweezers. Now you can get these on Amazon, five, six bucks. Um, what they have on here is they've got kind of a sharp teeth on here um, and they grab the pin bones. So these are pin bones right here, this little ridge right here. You can run your hand along it and feel it. So if you take your pin bone tweezers and pull them out like that, that works so, so much better than if you were to use your uh, needle nose pliers like you've always done. These grab much better. They come out at a certain angle. Um, you don't have to do what a lot of people will do is they'll take a knife and they'll just cut out that whole ridge of pin bones. But really the pin bone tweezers, Amazon, five, six, seven dollars. If you're a salmon fisherman or if you run into a lot of pin bones, there's no better tool to remove the pin bones than a pin bone tweezer.